Welcome, I'm from the Xiaomi Mi 11i and today I will show you how to bypass the Google verification on this phone. Now the phone here is locked, you can see the, the icon that is signifying it right here in the corner, lock icon, so yeah, to basically buy it, well, finish up the setup I would need to verify the uh, Google account or previously set screen lock. Now to bypass this, what you want to do uh, to start off is connect to Wi-Fi, I already am connected, and from there you want to scroll down and select Add Network, and then in the SSID field you want to type in youtube.com. And hold the text and select share, which is the link icon from YouTube. I'm going to tap on the account right here, go to help and feedback, and then in describe your issue, you're going to type in delete or disable. There we go. It comes up as a suggested delete or disable apps on Android. So I'm going to tap on it, then choose to. Uh, First step right here, go to the uh, application settings. And in here, we're gonna start off by selecting the Android setup. I'm gonna force stop it. Okay, then go back. Go back. There we go, that was kind of weird. That normally shouldn't happen. You should just be able to go back here. Now here, you wanna select more. Show system and scroll down to uh, G. We're, look we're looking for Google Play services. There we go, Google Play services. Tap on it, choose disable, disable app, go back and then scroll down to settings. There we go, settings and select open. And in the settings, you wanna scroll down to additional settings, accessibility, Accessibility menu and enable this, tap on OK, confirm whatever. And now you want to go back, 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 back once more and once more. There we go, Wi Fi. And from here, go forward. Select don't copy. And once you start seeing this, so checking for updates, I'm just going to kind of like glitch out as you can see. Uh, what you want to do now is click on the accessibility menu, menu, select Google Assistant, and this will show up settings for a brief moment. So what you want to do is select settings, then it will open up settings. Again, it's going to be relatively quick. And in the settings page, you will have enable options somewhere around here. Now you probably will see it once you open it up. So there we go, enable. And once you tap on it quick enough, it will be enabled. It, it won't close. Uh, normally it will close after a second or so. Uh, if you don't click it fast enough, you will have to just repeat this till you manage to select enable here. Once you do so, uh, go back once, give it a second and it will just simply go forward. So I'm going to select more and accept. You want to finish up the setup right here. So once you're on the home screen, you want to go into the settings. From here, you're going to scroll down to, I believe, additional settings. And oh, there we go. In the blue text, we have factory reset. Now select it, choose erase all data, factory reset, and then wait the 10 seconds here and another 10 seconds on the next message. And once you tap on the OK button, it will begin the process. Now, I won't go through the factory reset, it's just gonna take uh, unnecessary time. 
and it's a fairly straightforward process. It resets your device, you're back in the setup screen, and from there you want to set up your device however you like. It will be fully unlocked at that point. So that being said, uh, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.